Good evening, everyone. Welcome to Monday. Welcome to another another MechWorks Hobby Chat number twenty. That's exciting. I've been doing this for twenty weeks. Didn't didn't realize that. That's a that's a very cool thing. <laughs> No one's got the gnome beard. Thank you. I'm glad you appreciate the gnome beard. I don't know if I want it to be called a gnome beard, but I'll, I'll take what I can get. Yeah? Anyway, hi. Hi. Hope you're having a good week. Welcome aboard. This should prove to be interesting. And now with 100% more added danger, as I've only got super glue. This is all I've got. I've only got super glue. My, my actual regular glue ran out, and I can't find any other hobby glue that's easily purchasable at this point in time so that that'll be fun <laughs> um, I'm, I'm expecting to weld myself to my model at some stage but how how are we doing how is everyone doing here tonight hopefully you're doing well hopefully this week has started well for you and hopefully everyone also had a very very good weekend now let's get on to the main event tonight we're blind building. Oh, that's very bright. We're we're getting a very shiny. I'm just going to take that off. But yeah, you see, still shrink wrapped. I've I've uh, we're blind building the custom booster blaster. It's yet another particularly excellent uh, mini from the GW Orc range. Up oh, sorting the huge amount of bits. I love I love a good bits, bits box. It it makes me happy when you got lots of stuff to play with. Okay, I'm rebuilding my bits box since I gave most of it away. But we're getting there. Okay, so here we go. The custom booster blaster. I've only seen pictures online and the front. I've I've glanced at the back once or twice but haven't looked at it very much at all. Okay, so you'll notice that there is the instructions. Uh, I'm going to put the box over here so I can look at that with permission. But you'll notice here that there's the instructions. You'll notice it says, before assembling your miniature, please read through these instructions carefully. They're gone. They're over there. I don't even know where they ended up. So, I have never seen inside this box before. And the instructions are now on the floor. So, okay. Uh, well, let's have a look at it. Let's crack it open. Let's have a look at what we've got. Okay, to begin with, we got this massive base. I love, I love the massive base. No, no, don't give me the instructions back. I'm meant to be able to put them over there, sweetie. No, don't. No, no, I'm not meant to have them. I'm not meant to have them. Get them out of here. Put them over there. Thank you very much for picking them up, darling, but I'm not meant to have them. No. No, I don't. Okay, so, anyway. Oh, uh, Cinderpizzi says hi. And Joe says hi back. That is, that is, that, that, that's quite a big base. I love these big bases. And that is not much. You're right, Pagnov. However, they have been condensing their sprues. You get a lot, they get a lot more packed into their sprues of late. Like you go back to them in the old model, old model kits, there'd be a lot of space in here. But the technology's changed, has improved. Yeah, that's what I'm making, huh? Okay. I need to put that away as well, actually. I'm allowed to look at that unless permitted. Okay, so let's have a look here. Quite obviously we have what we have here is lots of wheels. The and wheels. and internals of said wheels. That looks like geary bits of some description, and there's that looks like a foot. That where's me? Where's me? I now have a pointy stick. <laughs> I can point at things properly without possibly slicing my nose off. There's a foot on a pedal, so I'm guessing it goes up that way. Got more bits and pieces around here. We've got. It looks like that looks like an orc with a metal spine. Let me see if I can bring that up for you. That that definitely looks like an orc with a bit of a metal spine. Interesting. Engine parts, engine bits, oh, sorry, I mean exhaust bits. More exhaust bits, sharp bits, that looks like ammo. Yeah, I'm feeling that over my head here. Focus isn't good, you're right, it isn't, is it? Alright, let me fix that. Thank you for that, Cinder, that is important. 
since most of my work is going to be up close, let's see if I can fix that. I'm very sorry about that, everybody. I, I do reset this, but it just doesn't seem to want to play. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, we'll, this is, we'll focus on this bit. This bit here. That's the target of the focus change. That's 266. What's 280 look like? How's that? Yep, I'm fairly happy with that. I think that's fixed it. Let us know what you think. I, f I feel like that's a sharper focus now. Yes, thank you very much for that. Cinder, I just realized I leant into the camera to look at that. Good on you, Simmons. So you just got my nose right up there. My apologies. Anyway, let's let's get into this mess. Let's start someplace. I just need to start. See that that that, that that's 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 how this is gonna kick off here. And I'm thinking this point looks like a good point. Yeah, we'll start here. We'll start here, people. This feels very adventurous. So, Pagnov, why are you sorting all your tau bits? Are you just feeling like it, or you, do you have a plan ahead or something like that? Okay, so yeah, ah, much better. Thank you, Cinder. That much better re, uh, detail there. Okay, so that's... Well, this is facing forward. This this is the forward direction. So facing towards me is forward. That that's good. That's good to know there. Okay. So let's be logical about this. I've got a feeling logic isn't going to help me too much, but we'll give it a crack. All right. We're gonna we're gonna do what we did last time and just start assembling bits that look like they should be going together. For example, I'm pretty sure that these. This here is engine parts. Give me the parts you know. Let's see. I need to be able to see the madness clear. Okay, there, hopefully the madness is clear for you, Cinder. <laughs> uh, give me the parts I know I would use in the future. And the rest of throwing in a Ziploc bag trying to sell it. Okay. Uh, do talk to me about that. Send me some PMs about what you what what, what you what you zip bagging, please, sir. Because I can always use more spare parts, and orcs can you pretty much utilize anything as a weapon. Okay, so that looks like an engine. That look like that looks like an engine mount to me. Hmm. Let's get my let's get centralized. So there's a great big engine piece. Oh, look at that. That would appear to slot in there. One happy accident to go. Thank you very much. All right, we're going to glue these engine bits together because there doesn't seem to be any other moving gubbiny bits in there. Apart from whatever is meant to go. Oh. There is a big hole there, isn't there? That looks like something plugs in. All right, well. Anyway, well. Hole mounting a Riptide Gatling cannon to a Rhino. That'll work for me. I mean, no, that's a terrible plan. You need to give those bits to me. Okay, so. We start with the gluing. The gluing of... Well, actually, I suppose in one way, super glue is easier and more brittle to break off if it doesn't work out, isn't it? So... I'm actually possibly going to appreciate the use of superglue at some stage during all this. <laughs> okay, so that plugs in there as per of evidence of the shape. Ah! Okay, so that, that makes sense, right? Right. And we've got some little notchy bits here. See the little notches there? Notches there and there. That's And notches at the front. 
and this big one at the back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can find what that plugs into. Because it would make sense if there was something for it to for that slot to go into, wouldn't it? Oh, hang on. For example, all right, well that looks okay, that's a front part. That's a front part to the engine. Good, good, good. See, that bit would plug in like that. Ha ha. Ha ha. That's confidence. Yes, it is. It is confidence silence. Or it's me forgetting that I really don't know what I'm... Actually, it wasn't... It's just impatience. I think it's more impatience than confidence. But we just got to get cracking. We can't just sit here and you know, theorize all night. Because that's not... That's, that's boring. It's boring to watch. People have come to watch an exciting thing happen. Possibly a disaster. And if I'm all too careful, there's always entertainment in that. Okay, so... That thing on the front, that is a very specific joggin in it. So where's the jigging bit that goes into the joggin? Okay. Alright, well, I'm a little worried about all these suspension pieces. I think that's going to be... Yeah. I, I, I'm a little concerned. You're in vault? Oh, you're in vault tomorrow? Tomorrow, so I'll put the good stuff aside and bring it with me. Oh, okay. Cool. I might be able to drop by. Uh, I don't know. I, I've got to, I'm working full time now, so I can swing by after work, but I won't be there in the mornings, mate. Okay, I'm stumped already. <laughs> that didn't take long, people. Well, when in doubt, make more things. Okay, so. I'm gonna start working on tires. I try to figure out what goes on the other on the other side of that. On the other side of that um, engine block, it makes sense if something mounted there, wouldn't it? I mean, duh. But what? That's. Oh, well, this is all one big piece. Okay, that's that's kind of cool. I wonder if that's the front or the back. So now that I'm trying to remember, I can't remember a thing about the box I looked at. <laughs> Got nothing. I, I just can't. I can't remember. Okay, so we've got... There's some tire bits. Here's some more tire, tire bits. Sorry. Do some of it, at least some of this on camera. My apologies, everyone. Yeah, I'm just gonna make all the wheels. It sounds like a really good idea. <laughs> and that's how Murray lost all his viewers because his puns were the worst. <laughs> yeah, right. I DM you after stream. Oh no. Oh. Well, so far these are very sharp little extra gubbinsy bits on these wheels. Ow. Okay, so wheels. We have wheels. Oh. Is that the inside or the outside? Oh, well, it has to be. Well, it has to go that way, doesn't it? Because you wouldn't have. Has to go that way because you wouldn't have it going that way. That would make zero zero sense. That doesn't seem to go there. That doesn't seem to go there. These don't seem to go anywhere. They have to. But they don't. See, you got this bit. And you got the inside bit, and you got the little notchy bit there. And when I stick them together, there's nothing for the notchy bit to notch to. But they look like hubcaps. All right, so I've gotten wheels wrong. How? 
All right, whatever. What if one of these plug into there? Hmm. Unless it, unless it's at the back. Maybe that's at the back. Maybe that's the back of the truck. Well, that'd be kind of cool. I think. Oh, oh, what's that? Is that? No, oh, no. Hmm. All right. Well, let's have a look at these other bits then. We'll, we'll, we'll start pulling these bits off and see what these are. All right. So, eh. that looks like a roof part to me. Hang on. And if these go like that. Oh, righty. Oh, look at that. Ow. Yeah. Okay, that. That helps me a lot. That. Ouch. You disconnect them without even knowing them? Yeah. Yeah, there's no instructions. Well, hi. Uh, that guy. That guy, 23. Oh, lol, 23, more importantly. Welcome back. So you last time here. Yeah, um, what I do here is tonight is a blind build. There's no there's no instructions at all. Um, they're on the floor and the box is on the floor, so I don't have that to work off either. So this is literally adventure time. <laughs> so, but it looks like these bits all go together at the back. So that's cool. That's helpful, right? That's that's a good thing. So we're we're getting that. Uh, that's progress. I'm going to go ahead and call that progress. And I'm thinking that that might just plug in there. Except it doesn't, because there's nothing for that bit to plug into, so I'm wrong. Okay, I'm wrong so far. That bit's wrong. Oh, wait, no, what's this? This is interesting. This looks like a cool piece. Let's put, I wonder if that was a clip. Was I meant to clip that bit? I don't know if I was meant to clip that bit. Well, I'm sure we'll find out shortly. Whoa. Let's just put the lights back, sorry. Yeah, it is a little frustrating, but that's just the... See, I'm trying to do the... Something entertaining. You know? And and hopefully this, this that's what this is. Okay, well, all right, we'll look at that. Look, that was too easy, wasn't it? Look, just blonk, blonk, done. That's plugged in. It's a piece of cake. Don't know what everyone's whinging about. You know what? I'm really confident with that. I'm going to glue it. And this is where I usually make mistakes when I go, yeah, I'm confident, I glue it, and then later I go, ah, shouldn't have done that. There we go. Gluing. Glued. Done. Set in stone. I wonder if this bit goes all the way back there. Oh, it does. Look at that. That plugs in there. Perfectly. This is smaller than I thought. That's what's thrown me out. Because you put that bit there and you get this bit on the side. And then you plug that bit. Because you've got a little... You've got a jogging bit here. And the little jigger bit goes in on the other side. You see, you've got that and that. And then the wheel plugs in there and you've got that bit. And so... Oh, nice. It all goes together. Hee <laughs> hee. Yeah. Haha! <laughs> ah, no, come back. I need the bit. Alright, so. I still don't know what goes in there, though. What? See, there's that big gap. And it goes like that. So something goes there. Like the front, perhaps. The front. Okay, let's, let's think about the front of the buggy. Front of the buggy. No idea. I mean, what is even this bit? What is that bit? And why is it there? <gasps> oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. You see how... Where's me pointy bit? There we go. You see how this has an angle and a and a little cut-out jigsaw bit there? Right? I'm wondering if that matches this. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Ow. Da. No. There we go. Okay. 
get in there and slice those bits off. Let's have a look. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, it's a fit. That's a fit. That's a fit. Now, let's, let's just make sure it doesn't go the other way. No, that's a terrible fit. That doesn't go that way. That definitely slots in there. Brilliant. And then you slot this bit in here. And you're laughing. Look at that. That's great. But we've got a we've got a we've got a notchy bit here. We've got a notch. Alright. We've got a notch bit there. So there'll be no oh. I want yep, yeah, alright, okay. I've I've seen sorry, I saw that off held that off camera. I've just noticed this is the dashboard. And there's a notchy bit on the other side. And that's about the same size as that notchy bit. So I'm gonna be brave. Actually, I haven't been very brave. I've been very, very oh, maybe, maybe. So I'm just gonna get brave now. Ouch! Hopefully, I'll bleed too much. I reckon that plugs into the blind side on that. And look at that, like a glove. You know what? I'm really confident about that bit. I'm super confident about that bit. How confident? This confident. Glue. Glued. Yeah. I'm just going to hold it there for a bit. And we're good. Look at that. Oh. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, that's going to bleed. Ah. Oh. Okay. This has officially got my skin on it. There we go. Ah. That's one. It's on me finger now too. That's really awkward. Anyway, yeah. All right. There's a chunk of my fingerprint on this model now. This is this is by virtue of DNA my model. There we go, and it fits in there like perfect. It looks good. It looks fantastically good. I think I'm gonna have a problem getting the orcs in. Maybe tough gluing it. Let's glue it. Let's just do it. You can't live your life in fear. But you can't have way too much glue. Glued. Done. Dusted. Uh, glue on the... There we go. There we go. We glued it. It's in. That's 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 a, that's a done deal. That's a done job. There we go. It's going to really annoy me. More coffee time. So what you been doing anyway, that guy? What has that guy been doing? Do you, are you getting any hobby done? Is this, is this your sort of thing? Do you... Have you been having a good week? That's the other important question. Okay, that looks pretty cool. I might just... Should I just glue that in and be done with it? I'm thinking I might. It does look like joggy bits, though, doesn't it? It looks like bits should slot in there. And there's a dent in there and there that looks like something should be kind of sticking out of it. So, I, I don't know. I don't know. Ah. Oh. Apparently there was glue down there, because that is now stuck. That was easy. Oh, now there we go. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Let's have a look at this. Let's have a look. Let's have a think. There should be bits stick. I, I swear there should be bits sticking out the side of that. It looks so orcish. It just, it's screaming for great big exhausts or something sticking out the side. Doesn't it? Just can't see anything. I mean, we've got lots of exhaust pieces. You know what? I'm going to build some exhausts. Let's, let's scoot all this over there. Let's start building some of these techie bits. That way, that way, I might be able to get a clue as to where they're meant to go. Oops. That had a lot of resistance when I pulled it out. I've got a feeling I left some bits behind that I wasn't meant to. Oh. I'm going to cut these bits first this time. OK, 
Okay. So, ow. Oh, look, they might... Do you reckon they might fit in the... They do! I wonder if they're meant to go there. That's going to be a real pain to figure out, actually. <laughs> That's going to be actually a more annoying thing to figure out than the rest of it. Possibly. That's a brave statement. I suspect I have not even begun to annoy myself with this model. <laughs> okay, so let's have a look. Apparently we got... Alright, you see? Got little joggy bits on the inside. I'm thinking these jiggy bits fit in there. These bits here. I'm thinking these bits go with those bits. This bit and that bit. Ah! Oh no! He's on the floor. But where on the floor? No. No. Ah! ah. Ow. Alright. We're back. Got it. <laughs> okay. Uh. <laughs> Ow. Alrighty. Yeah, no. Okay, so. It's my guess. And I think it's a pretty easy guess. Yeah, they go there. That was easy. Yay. I like easy. Every now and then easy is nice. There we go. Ta-da. Okay. Now, where they plug in, who, who, who can say? Who knows? Um, I'm guessing it might be the... Oh, that's an interesting piece. I've got more exhausts here to build, so let's build some more exhausts, and then I'll slowly figure out what's going on. He says, hopefully. Righty, righty, righty. Oh, that's why it's a little, a little laggy. Got that open still. Good work, me. Sorry, better shut a couple of things down here. Uh, righty. Uh, Sorry, everybody. There we go. Shut that down, shut that down, get rid of that. Very sorry. My focus is now back here. I am 100% committed to trying to not make a complete disaster out of this. Yep. I've been doing a fair bit of scenery work, actually. Been working on a lot of scenery pieces. And surprisingly, I haven't bled that much doing it. Open the GW page of them. Oh! Yeah! That's actually... That's not a bad idea, actually. I suppose I could do that if I get really stuck, but I much prefer you guys just to tell me about it. As we go. Actually, that's the thing. If you guys wanted to open up the page and give me... Give me hints as requested. That'd be cool. I mean, I don't know. I, I, I'm going to need some hints, I suspect. But, because that'd be even better than me looking at the image. Because then I'm absolutely relying on you. That'd be quite funny. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So... Alright, so we've got more exhausty bits. That should just click in according to the jigging and jogging bits. Like, those bits clearly go together. 
Yeah, no, no, I'm look, I'm look, I'm committing, I'm committing. I, 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 it's one of my key selling points on my Facebook page comments and everything else. I'm not backing out of it. To be honest, it's far too much fun. It's also a good test for the model designers if someone can actually figure this out. I need to come up with new material to say while I'm doing this. I've just realized I've said that every time I've done one of these. So, shush, Murray. Try to be original. Alright. Oh, that's really sharp. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow, ow. Does that look like an igniter on the exhausts? It looks like a flamethrower nozzle. Like a flamethrower igniter on the exhausts. That'd be kind of cool if that's what that did. That's more of them. There's a lot of... What's going on? I don't think these are just exhaust somehow. There we go. Hey, look, look, I just noticed some. You see all those little nodgy bits, right? I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that they probably slot into... Aha! Yeah! Which means the other ones would slot on the front. That is a lot of exhausts for this particular mobile. Whoop. Just going to make sure it goes the right way. Yes. So where's that other bit? What goes there? I'm missing a bit. I'm missing a bit of it. Where are those bits then? I mean, there's only one sprue, so it has. <laughs> that's a that's a grot with a pistol. Look at that. He must be hanging out the side of it or something. So where are the bits that go on the front of those bits? I mean, they can't be that hard, right? They just... They should look like exhausts. He says, staring forlornly. I can't see him. I have no idea. How can that be possible? It's, it's, it's just... <sighs> okay, let's be logical here. So, they look like that. So it's going to look like that on the other side, I'm guessing. Right? See that, see that patterning there? So it has to look like that on the other side. Theoretically. Of course, since these are orcs. I don't see them. So I'm not going to worry about them. Also very orky of me. Oh! You see the big curvy dent? They got a curvy jogging bit? I'm thinking these curvy side pieces will probably slide into those. I'm going to go ahead with a guess on that. Because that seems very orcish. Ha! <laughs> like a glove. Straight away into the glue. Let's get that done. Let's lock that away. No back mucking about here, people. Actually, plenty of mucking about. Constantly mucking about. Try trying desperately to figure out what I'm doing. Still don't know how those wheels are going to work yet. That's really frustrating. There we go. That's. Heading to, we're in the direction of success here on these, on, on the side panels at least. Which is nice. Novel even. Oh, isn't that pretty? There we go. Uh, okay. So, the next bit 
is a bit that goes in a place with things. All right, well, I'm going to I'm gonna start sticking these bits on the side of the... Where's my engine block? There it is. I'm going to start jamming these into place because that seems like a good plan. Oh, hang on. Let's, hang on. Let's be careful. I just noticed we got these big... You see that? I thought it was just engine detail, but there's not enough detail on it to be engine detail for this particular miniature. I'd say things are meant to slot there. Ah! I was wondering about these. You see how we got the like a little engine blocky bit with the slot on the underside? I'm thinking that's what they're for. I reckon they will go I reckon there'll be four of them and they'll go all over this engine. That's my guess. I'm gonna go one. Oh, there's another one. There's two. Yep, three, that's the third one. There'll be one more on here. That not understanding orcs could could very possibly not look anything like the other bits. <laughs> yeah, that's looking damn it. Oh, that'll be easy, he says. Oh, that's obvious. Bugger. <laughs> anyway, all right, I'll stick these bits on. I'm guessing there's no real logic to it. They just go on. Like, blunk. Let's go the other way. Doesn't fit. All right, they, they, they seem to go. Oh, oh, there's a notch. There's, an, there's a jogging bit in there. In there. I saw a thing that might go there. I was wondering about... Where is it? This bit. I was wondering about this bit. Because it looked like an engine part. But I couldn't see where it might go. Because it's got a big jiggy bit on the back. Right? I was wondering... Oh, where's that, where's that bit going to go? I'm thinking it goes in the front here. Uh-huh. What do you guess? Oh, yes, what a guess. That looks like it fits, doesn't it? Jiggy bit goes in the joggy, fits the joggy bit. That's good. Ow. The reason I keep saying ow when I'm doing base things, I've got hundreds of little spiny, splintery things from doing mulching on the, on the weekend. I think that's upside down. Nope. Nope, that now that looks definitely upside down. I'll go with the first way just in case. <laughs> Term of night is jogging bit. No, it's not jogging. That's 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 the uncomfortable in between space between running and walking. This is joggy. J O double G I. We'll go with joggy. That I will I'll accept that mispronunciation, but it's actually joggy. There we go, joggy, exactly. You know, like the dwarven, the uh, could be could be could be the fit the fitness freak dwarven brother of Roji or something. Don't know where I'm going with that. Okay, that looks weird. This doesn't seem to want to go where I'm expecting it to go. That why doesn't that face forwards? That seems to go that direction. Why? Why? All right, there it goes. Anyway, let's let's stick these bits on, shall we? Cool. Sticking bits on. Just chucking them on. Hope this works. Do -da. There we go. Engine block bit one. Engine blocky bit two. People who know anything about engines are probably cringing at me calling it blocky bits. I don't know what you'd actually call these things. Don't judge me. Ow. Stuck to my, I call it stuck to my finger. Oh, hang on. What if there's a specific way to put them so that they don't get in the way of the other ones? Didn't think of that. No, no. It seems equally stuffed. All right. Good. Put another bit down here. Oop. That's way too much glue. 
Nope, ran the wrong way again. In song. There we go. Another engine blocky bit on. There was. Ah, there it is. Found the fourth piece. Gee, I'm glad there was four pieces, otherwise I'd look really sillier than usual. There we go. Ah. Cool. Engine block is done. Probably should have shaved the extra flashy bits off the side first. Operation make it up as you go along is in full swing. There it goes that. Okay, okay. That is a bigger big old engine block. These bits don't go in there. These bits go somewhere important. Thinking out that way. I am still confused as to why these bits don't face backwards. Wouldn't that make sense with great big engine parts? But they very clearly are meant to go like that, facing forwards. I don't know why. But they very clearly are meant to do that. So that does that mean the other bits are meant to face forwards like that as well? Or they're meant to face backwards in a way? You know? But why are they face forwards? Why is the rum gone? And more the point, what what slots in the front there? What goes there? I don't see anything to go there. I, I don't, there's nothing here that slots into those pieces. I don't, great, stuck myself in the bottle. I don't see where or how. That goes anywhere. Alright, well, there's a couple of the other cool little pieces here that I'm going to pop off and work on. I don't get it. But this bit, very clearly, goes there. See that? That just sluts together. Oh no, the rum is gone. Alright, well that, that clearly slots together. There's no other fancy bits about that. That just clips in. I don't know why they've done so much effort to make that so very extremely clipped in, but it does. The jiggy and the joggy bits in there marry up something. Just, 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 clunk, done. Dusted. Ow! Oh, that's sharp. And now I'm glued myself. Again. Mm -hmm. Yay, super glue. So where does that bit go? And then what happens at the front? Why, why, why? You've got all these pieces, but now the front bit confuses me. Ooh. All right, that's helpful. That's a good start. This bit looks like some sort of axle-y part has a has the joggy bits that seem to fit these like that so which way does that go though and how does it go that way or does it go that way that seems to fit a lot better but is it accurate okay that could be the front right that could be the front somehow but I still don't know how that bit fits into that bit. I don't even know how the front goes on at all, actually. I have no idea what the front of this vehicle looks like. I cannot remember at all. Don't know what this bit is either. What is this bit? Does this go at the back, maybe? Because it's got curvy parts here. Maybe, maybe that fits in... No, maybe not. Alright, maybe it's just meant to go at the front, somehow. 
somewhere. No, that looks like it. That, that's got a big channel run in it, hasn't it? That looks like it fits on something else entirely. I'd say that's that's a, I pulled that off that piece off far too early. Okay, so front end components. No idea. Because that's meant to go in there, like that. And this is meant to go on there like that. Ow. See, see, there is method to what I'm doing here because everything will ow, then fit kind of together, right? Like that. See, that that's how that goes. Which is awesome looking. Look at that crazy, crazy, crazy orc symbols on the side. That looks amazing, right? That's great. That's good. That's fantastic. Where's the front bit go? What? What happens here? And why does it face forwards? Why does the big exhaust do that? Where do these bits go? Hang on. That slot piece at the front there, you see that? Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Right. Rightio then. That come back that plugs into there these are most some of the most stop it fine I'm just gluing it it's annoying me now keeps jumping off it isn't meant, doesn't go the other way does it no just stay there thank you that's a huge chunk of it look at that, that looks like it's come off one of the aircraft doesn't it that's an enormous exhaust Enormous. Maximus exhaust. Alright, so that goes like that. Good. That answers that question. I was not expecting that to answer that question. I was not expecting the answer to what goes on the front of the exhaust being more exhaust. I was expecting like a funnel or ah, or a thing. So, well, that's all good, right? That's all well and good. That... That all goes together. That's fantastic. But I don't understand. That appears to go backwards. You know, that that that's the front. This is looking ridiculous. That can't be Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. So put it like that, yeah? Now, going according to these, they all face forwards and look look stupid. Look, what is that? It's a forward thingy. That looks ridiculous. I mean, it looks almost like, a, like, like one of those pesticide tractors. Alright? What if... Ha ha! It's meant to go the other way. You idiot, Simmons. Look at that. It goes that way, so the exhaust is facing out the back, of course, but swept down low. It doesn't sweep up high. Well done, Murray. So glad I didn't glue those on earlier, because I wouldn't be able to get the rest of the chassis in. Okay, so now we're getting somewhere. Okay, okay, that's that's better. That's better. Now back to the other problem of the front bloody wheels which I don't know where they are meant to go Riven how 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 are the front wheels gonna be done well to begin with I'm tired of looking at that I'm gluing it just it's bugging me I'm gluing it And glued. If it's not meant to be there, I can break it off later because it's super glue and super glue comes across, it comes apart, part, a la carte, relatively easy. I'm a little worried about that notch down there now, though. <laughs> I'm wondering if that great big joggy bit is there for a reason. I can't see one. I'm going to pretend I didn't see that for now. 
Okay, so now I'm get if they go together, which they suggest it suggests it might. How do you? Oh, hang on, there's another bit here. That what does this thing do? Is that bit? Do we have any more bits of suspension-looking stuff? Not really. Not really, no. Everything else is kind of... Well, that's weird. Oh, there's two of these. They look like something important. Let's, let's, let's crack them off and see where that takes us. It's, it's it's the wheels that are going to do me in, isn't it? This is the bit that does my head in completely. It's trying to... Oh, hang on. No, wait, wait, wait. Nah. Back to doing my head in. Or... Oh, okay, look. we got a joggy bit there. A jiggy bit on this side. And some dents in there. You see the... Where's my pointy stick? You see the dents? Alright. It's not just because the orcs have had a prank. I am suspecting that that might... Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. That goes there. That's helpful-ish. At least I know where that goes now. That's cool. Ah! Brilliant! Love it. Okay, so. Little jiggy sticky addy bits at the front there. I was wondering what they clip into. But we've got joggy bits on the inside of that, so I'm guessing. Ta da! Not as stupid as I look. Do da, do da. Which is probably a good thing, otherwise, I'd probably forget to breathe. There we, there we. Oh, it looks beautiful. Unless that's upside down. <laughs> now it's a jet fighter. No, I'd say it's the other way around. Okay, I'm going to glue these. I'm going to get brave and glue these bits in. I think. Although that, whatever that is, can, no, no, that that's all meant to get together. Sweet. What are these bits? These look kind of important. These these appear to go in there, don't they? But also they don't at all fit there. Because there's going to be all these other bits in the way. I wonder what they're for. <sighs> Alright, anyway. We're going to glue it now. Come on. I really don't like using super glue for plastic models. It just, I just, I just don't like it. And that bit goes in there. Just like that. Brilliant. Love it. If anyone actually has the picture open, can they figure out if these are important? Because I'm starting to wonder if I'm going to care or not. I've got a real feeling that I'm not going to care much. Okay, so, theoretically, yeah, yeah, that doesn't work at all, does it? What are these stupid bits for? Why are they here? Do they just fit on the outside there? But that doesn't make any sense, because it... Huh! What? Apparently this has big double, double wheels at the back. Hey, skids, how you doing, mate? I have no idea what's going on here. Okay, so far I have managed to blind build an engine block, a front bit of axles. Skit says hi. Get out of it. Stop touching things. Skit says hello. Actually, you're right. That does. Yeah, because those little those little bits, you reckon? Fit into those little bits? Yeah. That's what I was just saying. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, there's a hand still on the wheels. But we've got. So I've built an engine block. 
and I've stuck the front axle bits on and I've got the back bit connected and the other bit connected and so far it hasn't fallen apart or hasn't been a disaster um, now we just got to figure out where the other bits go now now thank you skits uh, so now, now now it's see these bits go on the back right we figured out that these bits go to go on there and that's all that's all very excellent it's just it would appear though how very annoying that wait a minute that what is there another screwy bit in the like uh, yeah i don't know what that's meant to do okay i think I think I think okay I think I think we've got something here I think I've noticed something there oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. skits the I never even looked at the instructions this time they just got thrown straight at the floor and I've looked at the box art a few times on the front that's it I can't remember much of it but no leave the instructions out of it this is getting funny okay so I've just noticed something now have a look here you can see you got little little tiny joggy nobbles all around the outside right all, all around there see there's little denty bits and I just noticed that we've also got little denty bits oh you got the jiggy little little tiny jiggy bits on the outside there so theoretically I mean it kind of halfway looks like that you'd stick these two together right they that actually fits well and everything lines up the problem with that plan no the plans perfect I was thinking that these might go on the outside right because they also slot in but then you got this weird little wibbly wheel didn't you yeah. oh look at that you got these little bit you got these you got you got these joggy bits here right and they will line up with the front jog with the jiggy bits on the okay okay so so these are not the hubcap bits that go on the outside of the big wheels these actually make little wheel there they are look at that you got the key the key shaped jiggy joggy bit and the key shaped jiggy bit and they go together to make little baby wheels no they don't I've got it wrong Yes, I do. Look at that. That's really sharp. That. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Look at that. That works. I'm gluing it before I lose it. How do you know it goes together? Guesswork, darling. I, I know it goes together because of guesswork. This is this is fantastic. I'm feeling. You know what? This there's a thrill to figuring this thing out. Get away. Don't you lose me bits, hun. Would you just leave my bits out of this? Actually, stop, stop bit fiddling and put it, put me bits back, woman. It doesn't work with this one unless you got double wheel. I think it's meant to be a double wheel, darling. I'm really hoping that's the way this is meant to be. But yeah, this is exhilarating, guys. I this is a lot more fun. No, no instructions at all. This is a bit of a blast. This this is some good value. No, no what are you doing? All right, so there we go. That goes out together. Ah, oh, skids. <laughs> Stop it. Okay. Yeah, I'm having a ball, darling. Not as much fun as skids is with her innuendo at the moment. But anyway. Okay, so I'm thinking that these big, these are big fat tires. At the back. Hee hee hee. Look at that! Brilliant, big chonking tires at the back, little, little stabbly wheels at the front. I'm gonna glue this before I think about it too much. You see me blind rushing into glue things, skits? It's great fun. Ow! Oh, this bloody model is so stabby. There's more sharp bits on this than chaos models. Now that might be interesting, blind building a serious chaos model. 
But anyway. There we go. Ow. Okay, so. Wheelie bits. The wheelie bits are at the back. The other bits are at the front. We got exhaust bits. We got whatever that is. We got. Don't want these. Oh, hang on. Okay, hang on. Because I so I noticed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that'll do it. There we go. Look at that. You see? You see that there? So we got these little. We got the joggy bits there. We got three joggy bits. I've just noticed because. You see that little dent there? That would be something important because this little bit, I reckon, will slot into that bit somehow and look all technifunkel and all wonder buttons or something. <gasps> I'm right. I'm so right. Oh, I'm so happy. Look at that. That's how the wheel goes on the front. You sit on it. Pagno, have you stood on an entire Chaos Land Raider in the dark? Well, I, I'm crippled because I stood on a D4. If I'd stood on a Chaos Land Raider, my leg would probably just exploded or snapped off or something. But, look at that. That all goes. That goes so good. I'm so excited. I'm, gonna, I'm, just gonna, I'm so excited. I'm just going to glue it right now. I'm jumping straight in with this. It's time to glue. Glue, glue, glue. Make the glue happen. It's gluing time. No, nah, no, come back a little bit. I've got so much glue over my fingers. I've actually lost. I've lost the ability to grip. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. Here we go. It fits like a glove of pain and spikes. It fits like a slanishi glove. Look at that. I'm really proud of myself for figuring that out. Ha 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 was all doom and gloom before I before I figured that bit out. Oh, this is terrible. I'm bad at this. But now I've figured it out, of course. I was like, I'm a genius. Okay. Glued. There's no turning back now. That doesn't look right. The front wheels will dodge. The front wheels are leany. He's leany wheels. I've done something wrong. What have I done wrong? Is it upside down? Can't be. It can't be upside down. It wouldn't fit, would it? If I inverted that and then switched it over, that wouldn't that wouldn't work. I think. No, that looks right. That looks right. That looks good. Unless I got the wrong wheels on. Yeah, that's pos ow. Ow. Ow, 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 ow! Super glue. Ow. Ow. Oh. That's good glue. Nope. They're the same either way. I just hurt myself for nothing. I did probably deserve that. Go. Put them back. You know what? Okay, he's got wibbly wheels. I'll live. So, you know, it's a bit of a low rider at the front. That's the thing, right? Well, either way, if it, 
if it's a thing or not, that's getting stuck in there. That looks so cool. That looks so good, I'm going to glue it in now. Fearless. Possibly just brainless, but we'll go with we'll go with the positive on this. There we go. Vroom vroom vroom. Vroom vroom screech. That's just too cool. And then the next bits go in like that. And it's gonna look amazing. But first I need to put gigantic exhausts on. Gigantic exhausts on. Like that. And then I'm assuming these other bits. Yeah. Ha! Huh. Ow! Ooh. But I think these bits have to go on first, otherwise I'm never going to get them in, am I? Which means I need to do the orcs now, because then I'm never going to get them in. Fine. I was having fun building this, but now I have to try and build orcs. Which is also fun, but still. Okay, so let's just carefully put that to one side. And move on to the orcs. Don't know what that bit does yet. We'll figure that out later. Okay. So, one will be the driver. One's going to be the gunner. And there's other people sitting inside, I think. I think there's multiple orcs in this machine. Now, this is a bit that's going to frustrate me. Because I have no idea. I have no idea how many orcs. Or where. But it shouldn't be too hard to figure out. If I can build the rest of this thing thing blind, I can do this, right? All right. Okay, so. You see the little oh, orky dude? Orky body. He's got the angles. Oh, dear. Come on. There we go. He's one foot up, one foot down sort of thing. So I'm thinking he just slots on there. There's no seat. And when you look at that, when you sit him on, there's a bit of a gap. So I'd say there's meant to be a seat there. That's going to be annoying. Where's his seat? Where's the rest of him? It was a steering wheel. That's cool. I'm going to take that steering wheel off. Oh, there's a hand on the there's a hand on the steering wheel. Ow. There's a hand on that steering wheel. Look at that. So, wherever that slots in, it's it's meant to line up with the uh, with the rest of him. So, you know what? I'm just going to chuck that in now. You laughing at skits, all right? You want to see some pain, all right? I am going to just chuck this steering wheel in. Like that. I have no idea if that's meant to go in yet, but there it is. Steering wheel in place. Ta-da. Vroom vroom. That looks like something slots in there. That looks like something slots in there too. No idea what yet. I wonder what goes there. Could be anything. There's a wide variety of perhaps is happening here. I think these are all cyborgs. They all seem to have a wide variety of cybery bits going on here. Still haven't found the. Oh, yes, I have. I think. Maybe. That. I'm thinking that this might be the. Um, I'm thinking this might be the seat. Because on that underside, kind of fits the pattern of that block with the, with the notch in it. So, well, let's find out, eh? Yep, look at that. Like a glove. Does it go the other way? No, it does not. And there's something on the... Oh! Okay. There's little... There's little tiny joggy bits in there. So I'm thinking... I'm thinking there must be some sort of thing in the back that 
gays in there as well. That's me think. Oh. Mm. Ooh, so much blood. Okay, so. Uh-uh. -oh. That looks important. Wonder what that plugs in there. Wonder where out. Wonder if that was meant to plug in somewhere. And I've missed it. Oh. I think I've got the backrest for the for the for the driver here though. Is what I was trying to say before. Yeah, dude, look at that. He's got oh, he's got his little seat. Nope, little seat jumped off. Well, his little seat's getting glued in, so it doesn't do that again. Yeah, he's got his little deck. He's got, it's, 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 that's the saddest little chair. <laughs> There is zero comfort to be gained from this chair. That chair is merely to stop you leaning back against the fuel tank, apparently, and burning yourself. So I'm thinking this little dude, there we go, look, he sits in there all happy like. Yeah, I'm an orc. Now, let's bring up something. Where's his, where's the top of his body? You know, they've got half, got half an orc there. So where's the rest of himself? And what does it look like? And how does it go there? And where's his arm? Oh, hang on. Okay, hang on. I think that is the arm. Okay, that looks like the arm that would fit into the hand there. Okay, so. Alright, so we've got the arm that fits into the hand. Don't have the orcs and lazy boys. Yes, they just don't have the rest of him. Okay, well look, there's a whole bunch of no, oh, go away. There's a whole bunch of other bits up here that I'm going to look at now. So let's grab some more parts and see what see what we can build. That's a very strange piece. It's got a fair bit of cyber cybernetics in there actually. Which is like a terrible idea for orcs. And a crank at the back, for whatever reason, there's a crank sticking out. Uh, it, looks like a hand. it is a hand, darling. It's a hand holding a grenade. I'm just trying to find the rest of him now. There's another bit. And here's another body bit. Woo! There it goes. No idea how that... Oh, hang on. Does that somehow obscurely... No, he knows. Although this bit seems to fit... Ah! Okay, there we go. That bit fits on that bit. So that's helpful. I'm actually wondering... I'm wondering if I want to use some of the um, the bandana faces from the pre from the other model. On some of these dudes, because that might look really nifty. Switching it up, put a bandana face on this guy. Although I think he's meant to have a cyber cyborg head. Uh, yeah, okay, go for it. Um, yeah, it's Skits, sorry. Skits is offering to show me a working picture of a Sponky Chonk Tonk. I don't know what that is, so I'm going hey, what are you doing, Joe? Yeah, go for it, huh? Have a look, see what you can come up with. What's she showing me? What's she showing me? Oh! Oh, that's one of the Nurgle bomb things. Where's that going there, do you reckon, Joe? I thought it might have. 
I see what you're thinking though. Yeah, yeah, that's. Maybe he's an Autobot, huh? Yeah. Like he's a Transformer. It looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah. I love the way you think, sweetie. <laughs> Seriously, that's maybe he's an Autobot needs to be wound up. Well, you're right. Actually, this bit does go on the other guy, hun. You are actually mostly correct. He is a clockwork orc. That is bizarre. Clockwork orc. So such a he's got a crank. He's got a crank handle to wind him up. That's funny. All right, I'm going to put this orc in here. I'm going to glue him in now. I've decided that I've had enough mucking about with the maybes. He's getting glued. Done. Glued. That dude is in. He's a cranky orc. <laughs> That's what Skits just said. He's a cranky orc. Congratulations, Skits. That is the pun of the evening. Well done, buddy. That is awesome. That is, Joanna loves the way you think. Congratulations, you have got a genuine laugh out of Joanna there. You wouldn't want to wind him up. Wouldn't want to wind him up? Really? <laughs> <sighs> Joanna just doubled down with a, you wouldn't want to wind him up comment. There we go. It only gets worse for me from here. Unbelievable. Oh! You know how orcs are basically glued to the wheel, these guys? This guy's cybernetic arm. Okay, you need to have a high five, apparently. There we go. This guy's arm literally ends in a crank that, f that plugs into the gear stick. That is, uh, that is actually a little sad. Poor Orc. He literally doesn't get to get out of this vehicle. He is actually mechanically bound into it. Mind you, considering Orc lifespans and how li fast they like to go, this is probably an, a dream come true. Have no, no, darling, he doesn't have a screw loose. Wow. Thank you, sweetie. Okay, so there we go. That is one orc in a truck with a cybernetic hand that is actually welded to the gear stick. That's alarming. Wow. Now, I think I found his head, and it's a really cool cyber orc, cyber orc looking head. And I think I want to save this head for another model, to be honest. <laughs> Weld me in, boys. You see, that, that fits on there like that, and that looks pretty neat, right? But I'm thinking, what if I went the bandana orc for this one? What if I did a different orc head there? Instead of this, because I could... Re ah, stop falling off. I could reuse this head on like a mech boy. I don't know. Hey, Flynn, how we doing? Welcome aboard. We, I am in the, we are in the process of building yet another Orky vehicle. And this time it's a true blind build. I threw the instruction plate, uh, instruction book on the floor. And I haven't even... Uh, looked at the box art, so we're going okay. It's a bit, it's moderately disastrous, not entirely disastrous so far. Actually, it hasn't been disastrous at all, I've just stabbed myself several times and kind of glued myself several times. I don't actually have any regular glues, it's just super glue tonight, so that's all shades of disaster. Um, do I want to use this head here, or do I want to use it on a different model? Now I'll use this head here. It is a very cool head. It is particularly designed for this this mini, so I'm going to go ahead with that. Go ahead. <laughs> it 
There's that orky lad driving his green, green heart out. So, I think it's fairly safe. What do you reckon, Council? Is it safe enough we've whacked that door on now? I reckon it's safe to whack the door on. I'm going to do it. It is going to be a bit of a dog to paint this miniature in many ways later on. But this is a build thread. You're not here to see me build half a model. You here, see, you're here to see me make an impossible task for myself. And you'll all get to hear me whinge about it later anyway, so when I have to build it. Stabby Stabby Antique Car. Yeah. It, it, it pretty much is that. Yeah. We're all glued in. Okay. That's pretty nifty. Now, if the other side goes on as easy, it's also super nifty. And then this bit pops on the top, from what I can tell. All like that. Which is extra nifty nifty. Swifty nifty. However, what's this bit do? Questions like that. And then there's a lot of other bits here. Like there's a lot of parts on this model now still. Like where does... Where does this bit go? It looks like it's... Well, very important would go somewhere impressive. I don't, I don't know. Well, let's start. Let's just... Shall I glue him? Alright, I'm going to leave that bit off just in case for the moment. Oh, no. I've got to finish the front, haven't I? Finish this experiment. Blot, 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 blot. Lots of glue. Ain't no glue like overglue. Stick that bit in there. Stick that bit in there. And we have some truly fearsome exhaust happening there. That is amazing. Unless eh, that's meant to go on the other side. Is it meant to stick up, perhaps? It could if I wanted it to. But that looks like it's going to get wiped out by the front wheels every time they hit a bump. So, I'm going to go back with my original plan and put them here. There we go. Exhaust. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, such a powerful looking vehicle. Right, now. Worry about that other side in a minute. Got the roof bit. I'm assuming that's what this ring's for. This looks like a pintle swing ring. This is where you'd mount a weapon of, of large caliber, I'm guessing. Make the grots, you reckon? Okay. One second, Commander. Yep, that, that pops in there perfectly. However, I don't want to glue that yet because I've got a feeling that would be way early. Okay, the grots, the grots, the grots, the grots. There's multiple grots. Why are there more than, why is there more than one grot? Where does he go? Oh no! I've just been gluing things. I might have wiped out where the grot's meant to live. This dude's just jumping through the air with a pistol. Look at him! Yeah, He's looking super happy with his life. Which is impressive for a grot. I think I found his head. Ow. Ow. Yeah, ow. How you doing, by the way, Flynn? Hope you're doing well. Hope your week is going to start well. And I hope you had a fantastic weekend. Or, at the very least, not too bad. Got to stick a grot, got to stick a grot, got to stick a grot on where he goes. You know what? 
this this grot looks amazing. This is the Vin Diesel of action grots. Look at him. I don't want to put him on this. I want to find somewhere else to put him. Where else could I put him? Where else could I put him? There's got to be somewhere cooler. The way he's hanging on to something. What if... Oh, I'll be back in a second. Excuse me, switch button thing. There it is. Ha ha! I figured that out. Oh, hanging off a copter. Oh! I didn't think of that. But what I did think of, see, I went and stuck in a boss pole on the back of the other truck. Uh, 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 of this be be beautiful beast of a thing. What if I had the little dude swinging off a grub pole? Like an absolute boss. Like, only just avo whoops, sorry, only just avoiding the exhausts. Like, just hanging off the back, taking shots of people. What do you reckon, eh? I reckon that looks, uh, that'll, that'll look just great. Ah, come back. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Swinging like a little ninja off the back of the boss pole. I love these miniatures, man. I love these things so much. Ha ha ha! Look at that! Where are we? Sorry, look at that. So this would be hooking along at top speed and you got... A little grot hanging off the back with his, with it with with his pistol. Oh, that is just too good. <laughs> oh, I'm look so looking forward to building or oh, painting these minis. Now I have to be careful he doesn't get he doesn't snap off constantly, and I I, I kind of feel bad that I've sacrificed I've taken him off or sacrificed him from that model for this model, but that's just that looks oh and. From the top down, it's actually in line with the rest of the model. Didn't actually mean to do that, but that's... That's cool. I'm so extremely happy with that. <laughs> Bit more super glue. glue. Blow it into the cracks there. Okay, I'll, let, I'll put that over there to dry. I'm so happy with that idea. <laughs> okay, where was I? I was building building bits. That's right. But there's still another grot. There's still another little spannery grot here. I'm actually thinking about getting a hole, getting a ba getting a pack of Gretchen, just to stick on other vehicles and just to stick around things because they look cool. You know, just actually use them as accessories for other vehicles. Now, this little dude seems to be pulling on a pulling on a lever with every bit of his might. Alright, so, look at that. There he is, pulling on a lever. Tearing himself up. Look at the, actually the musculature of this little grot. You know what? They look tiny and stuff compared to the orcs. 
but they'd probably flog up a human. They're probably nasty. They're probably vicious and really hard things to kill. Now, where does he... I've got no idea where he would go. On the side? On the top? Alright, you sit over there until I figure that out. Out the window? What? Out the window? Alright, so it's on that side, is it? There's only one window. The window, the window, the second story window. There's only one, there's not a lot of room in this, Cinder. Maybe you're just messing. Oh, I think. Yeah, okay, so that little, we've got a joggy little notch bit at the bottom there. I've lost, there we go. That I think, if Cinder's not just spinning right, yeah, okay, yeah, all right, like that, leaning out the window, right here, right here, right here. For a second there, I thought Cinder was having a bit of a laugh, having a bit of a go. So you reckon he's, he's leaning out the window like that, eh? Well, I'm going to trust you and just glue it. I'm done here. Done with that side. Glue, glue, glue. Go, go, go. Oh, I shouldn't have done that yet because I've got to stick this on. Alright, wiping the glue off. There we go. Going to bed, hon? Alright. See you later, sweetie. Love you too. Uh, see you soon. Joe's going to bed, people. Good night. Bye-bye. <laughs> Skit says good night. Cinder says good night. Oh, Flynn also says good night. Good night, Flynn. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'd say Pagnov would say goodnight as well. If he was online, he's doing other things at the moment, though. So, yeah. All right, you go, hun. You have a good night. Uh, I'll be in soon. See you, sweetie. Okay. So, oh, Pagnov does indeed say goodnight. Pagnov, goodnight. <laughs> Joanna says goodnight to all of you. Okay, so what I'm building here looks like some big kind of cannon, which is exciting. Is that? Looks like there's a round in the... There's a round in the gun? That's a degree of attention to detail I was not expecting. There's two rounds in it. The designers just having a fun, aren't they? They're just, they're just going, no one's ever going to see this apart from the person that puts it together. That's just cool. And I think this goes like that. Maybe. Maybe it goes like that. Maybe it goes like that. I have no idea which this way this goes. I am going to have to say it goes like that, because that matches the way that the other ones are in. These look like rivets. These look like rivets. Now I'm not going to paint them. Don't have to do anything. Watch me go. I'll paint them to look as cool as possible. But I'm not going to kill myself trying to paint rivets inside a gun. That's a bit of a stretch. Oh, have you guys? If you, if you, if any of you jump on the um, jump on the G Dub website, you'll notice that you got limited edition. 
um, actual action figures. Space Marine action figures coming out. I'm very tempted. I mean, that's just a little too cool. Does it say... Oh, if, if someone could jump online and check it for me. Does it say when they're releasing or when they're out of, you know? Like, is how limited is limited and when is it available sort of thing, please. That would be very appreciated. March next year, obviously. Twentieth. Next year, the twentieth. Hmm. Is it pre ordering now or is it uh Okay. Well oh, running out of time, crap. Alright, I wanted to get this done tonight, but I got all distracted by other things. Yeah, you, you, you doof, Simmons. Get on, old boy. Go faster. Now is not the time to dally. It is now time to speed along and make in, make, make poor choices. Sorry, I keep... It's a two-week window. What, the, the pre-order is a two-week window now? Ends this coming Saturday. Do we have a price on those? I'm expecting a hundred bucks each minimum. I'm going to go ahead and assume that these go here actually. Wow, I didn't even think, I didn't even double check, I just went with it. Good grief. Made to order product. That's intense. Oh, okay. I now know what that is. I'm pretty sure that that, that bit is a bit that this sits on to gain, keep its balance. It's like it's a little levery bit. I don't know what the correct term is. I'm tired. I'm pretty sure that will go in there. Yep, like that. Ta da brilliant. Uh, hmm. Well, that's interesting. Okay. McFarlane Toys actually sells Marines and Necrons. Necrons. Marines and Necrons. I did not know that. It was probably good that I didn't know that. But now I know that. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Wasting time. Time we don't have. Time, time, time. There is no time. Uh, big horny bits. I don't know what to do with the big horny bits. He unwisely says the skits online. Um, that looks another... Ah, nuts. Where's that meant to go? That's a bit of ammo. And this is a very cyborg looking noggin. And I still don't know what this bit does. Tusks, thank you. Tusks, they call them tusks. You're quite right, Cinder. And chains! Chains? Really? Why? Why are there chains? Okay, that is all of... Oh, nope, there's a little tiny orky noggin head. Little tiny orky icon right in the middle there. And that is all of the pieces on that gun. Gee, I hope that was all I needed. <laughs> anyway. That bit I'm assuming goes in there. Cool. Come out, come out, come out, come out. No, no, not a fl Oh, what a catch. Lightning reflexes. Okay. Uh, this bit would go... Uh, the Nodgy bits go in... There we... Yep. That... Yep. Good. That works. Okay. Do, 
do, do, do, do. Got a rush. Got a rush. Running out of time. Got a rush. That's backwards. That's not right either. Just keep doing it until it fits. There we go. Ha ha. Semi victory. And this bit, Joanna figured out, it plugs in there. Alright, so that's cool. We got a pluggy bit. That's sorted. That looks wild. What is the... Oh, hang on. Where's that ammo bit? I wonder if that... No, it doesn't. Alright, never mind. But this looks like the other side. Of the same... Okay, it does go there. So what is this? What goes in there? Does this bit go in there? I don't know. I don't know where that bit goes. I'm thinking this all fits on the outside of the... But it can't be... Ah! Stop it! With the bleeding. Alright, that... That looks like it all goes together like a great big custom mega cannon thing. That's kind of wild, isn't it? But we've got this extra bit here, and I don't know what to do with. This looks like a bit of... something. Maybe it goes... Ah, maybe it goes there. Maybe that drops in there like that, and then this looks like it's just reloading. Constantly. <sighs> it does. Well, that looks good enough to actually weld. Gonna go ahead with the plan. Oh, where'd it go? There it is. No, come back. Please don't do that. Alright, that just... No! Alright, that just starts to fall off. Because it didn't glue it together, Murray. You didn't glue it, mate. At least didn't go properly. There we go. Proper job done. I think. Oh, that's close enough, right? Then that goes on there. Like I bought one. Brilliant. Loving it. Could someone kill that? Either anyone with mod access, could someone get rid of the thank you? Alrighty. And a credit to my mods. Mod, whoever's got access at the time. Bots last about mm, ten seconds. Okay. Ah, I see. I think. I think this bit is meant to go in here somehow. Or something. Don't know how. Don't know what this bit's meant to do. I think it's meant to slot onto there. And maybe go to the front as a. I don't know. I don't know what that's meant to do. So this bit plugs in there. Like that, I'm assuming, yeah? Then Orc Boy go pops in there. But what's this little roller bit for? And why? Because it very definitely fits on there. But where? Oh! I think I just found out what this bit's for. We've got a pluggy bit there and a pluggy bit there. Did you... And it all jiggy and joggies in! Naha! <laughs> It had to make sense at some stage, right? You just got to eliminate your options. And eventually, it all comes together. It all comes together, skits. It all comes together. You just have to guess enough and hit it with a, hit it with a hammer. And it's good, mate. Look at that. This has been a triumph of guesswork tonight. I'm 
I'm very amazed that this has worked at all. I just don't know where this bit goes. Like, literally no idea what that bit's meant to do. Oh, that bit does. I'm just going. I'm just going to glue that bit in because I know what that does. This has been a triumph of creative thought and interpretive actions and sheer bloody-minded guesswork, mainly. Mainly. Ow. Okay. So he pops in there like that, right? What does this bit do? Stupid. It's a stupid bit. Ow. Does nothing. Why is it there? Oh, that's why it's there. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. This is the bracing for the gun so it fits properly. I see. I see. Yep, no, that fits perfectly. It's okay, skits, I got it. My guesswork was superior once again. Actually, honestly, I can't believe I've been this lucky this often. <laughs> it defies all odds, actually. I shouldn't. Look at that. Fantastic. Fantastic pants. I shouldn't have been this lucky uh, or this fortunate in guessing this much, this well, this often. That's silly. I'm... Ah, ah. Ow. I've just glued myself back into my thing again. And I'm just going to glue in here because I do not want it rolling around on my track. It's probably meant to be able to swivel around. Spivel? Swivel. But I don't care for that rubbish. Every time I do that, something falls off or falls out or disappears somewhere it shouldn't. I might put on a slight angle though. Yeah, slight angle. There we go. There we go. Look at that, lads. Ladettes, ladies. And the occasional gent that bothers to turn up as well. Alright, I'm pretty sure he just plugs straight in there. Just jam that head in. Go on. Get some. Look at that. He's just happy to be here with that enormous cannon. Happy little orc with his massive, massive gun. Massive gun orc. Go orc. Go orc. Go orc. There we go. I just made it makes even more sense now. Of course, it's Gork, the gun orc. All right. Now that flashing will. Though there's little. Gribbly bits will definitely be a problem if they, if they are left there. Because that's meant to fit really nicely, I'm seeing. Alright, so what do you reckon? I think I've done pretty good for the night. I think I've done rather well. I'm rather rather pleased with me. I'm feeling a bit... I'm feel, I may allow myself a moment of smugness even. It's not often I have any sort of plan like this that comes together, all right? So, <laughs> Yep, that looks... That's bloody brilliant, that is. And one moment of smug is authorized. Thank you. I will take a single moment of smug. Because I was... Honestly, I didn't know what to expect. 
I am now even more encouraged to do blind builds as often as possible. Ah! Because this was fun. Ow. Stick it all together like it's meant to be there. There we go. No, stop doing that. And that bit goes onto that bit, which goes onto that bit, which attaches to that bit, and there we have a buggy. Check that out. Oh, let's put the rest of the exhaust on. It's not done yet, Simmons. What are you doing? What are you doing, son? Not what people have come to see. There we go. That's looking better. Yep, alright. Chains it. Where are the tusks? Oh, you reckon? Hee <laughs> hee! Yes! I wonder how I'm going to put those tusks in. I can have the tusks stabbing outwards. I can have the tusks. I can have them face. I'm going to face them up like proper tusks. That's what I'm going to do. Well, good news is I have not yet super glued my hand to my face. I sketch will be very happy to know that I have actually. So I've been off camera most of this, haven't I? I've been over here doing it. I'm really sorry. Sorry, everyone. Although my fingerprint is still in, in here. I'm missing a fair bit of finger fingerprint on this finger. Because um, it's inside the actual vehicle. My DNA is, is, has been implanted into this particular. What do the chains go? And why are they here? The hell are the chains for? I'm just going to stick them at the back like they're flying off. Like, wee! Where's the other chain gone? There it is. <sighs> Guys, I got I got like seven minutes if I want to if I want to knock this over in exactly two hours, and I have no idea where the chains go. I'm just gonna make that up. Hang on, that's got a funny little angle, hasn't it? Front of a cab. Scared. Do you want to read these later? I have to try and explain half of it. Attached to the root. Oh! From, from, you mean from here to here? That sort of thing. Alright. The Pidgey says they go there. So I'll give it a go. This would be much easier with proper glue. I just have to guess where that's going to end up. Eh. Eh. Oh. That. Ah! No. No, come back. That's the wrong way. That's the wrong bit entirely. Don't do that. All right. And maybe if I just force it a little bit back. It's super glue. Alright, I think I think you meant that. Is that what you meant? Like uh, where are we like that, buddy? Yeah? Alright. Oh, you've got the picture open as well, Avi Skits. Sorry, back on camera. God, I'm getting tired. I'm not on camera as much. My apologies. How many of you have had this? Have had the picture open the whole time and been going mad as I've been trying to figure it out? Oh, that's how it's meant to go. 
That looks much better at that angle. Look at that. I did that entirely by accident. So if I just try to pop this bit off and not break it, perhaps? Eh. No, all right. That's just, all right. It's off center. It's orcish. Whatever. It's very off center. That's going to bug me forever. Okay, let's do something stupid. Oh, ha, ha, didn't. No! Ah, snot blocks. Where'd that go? What even was that? I don't know what that was, but I'm out of time. So that's just tough. Okay. There we go. And a little bit more super glue off the top there. Just hold the bloody thing in place now. Okay. I've had it open for the last half hour watching me kind of lose my mind trying to get in the right spot. That leaves one tiny little orky glyph that I don't know what to do with. I might put that on something else at another stage. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm going to put that someplace else. But look at that. <laughs> there we go. Done. It's done. In just under two hours, low by just in like six minutes under. I have, uh, two minutes under, sorry, I have completed the wagon. You prefer to watch me flail, good. Well, that's the idea, right? That's why you're here. That's, I'm just going to look at the front of the box now. Let's have a look here. Alright, a couple of variants, variations there. I've got the chains totally wrong. Well, not totally wrong, but wrong enough. I've got some of the, the engine block bits in the wrong spot. Yeah, the grot was meant to be hanging off the back, but he's not now because I'm. We've we've upgraded him to the boss's vehicle. Ah, okay. And that little orky glyph is meant to go over this seam line. Apparently, it's designed to go over the over the front of that busted bit. Which is a good spot to put it, because I made a real mess out of that part. Don't know how I managed to do that, but I did. I've learned not to underestimate my ability to, to, to upset things. There we go. Where's me nudge and stick? No, don't set yet, you monkey. Oh, that's 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 there now. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! That was a lot of fun. I am so looking. Oh, I'm loving that mini. That is wicked cool. Look at that. That is so nice. Yeah, I'm super impressed with this buggy. I should find the instruction. Oh, I saw the way over there. I was about to tell you what it, what it all does. I'm, but no, that, 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 that's, that's looking fantastic. Got a grenade boy. Got the rivet gun, I assume. I think it's a rivet gun. I think I saw that. I'm assuming these are flamethrower effects because we've got we've got igniter nozzles on the end of on the edge of each uh, exhaust point. Great big chunky engine, stabby bits at the front, wheels very uneven, I'll have to fix that. Oh, now you know what, I'm going to have to model it, like, hang on, where are we? I could, mo I could, be I'm going to base it doing a, doing a wheelie. That's what I'm going to do when I do it. I'm going to put something, uh, put something at the back to prop it up, and base it doing a wheelie. 
<laughs> well, there you go. Thank you very much for coming along. Thank you for enjoying this foolishness, for staying with me and your occasional good advice. Um, tonight went so much better than expected, didn't it? I I made no major errors. I've only I've got most of my fingerprints left. I didn't bleed. My coffee's I think my coffee's cold. Yep. Yep, that's cold. That's gross. Um I think that went well. Thank you for joining us. No demons were summoned. No accidental Latin phrases were announced. I, I didn't have Zen step in and say, Hey, how's sup? I am thinking next to... Oh, maybe I should have given him a little baby mohawk. I should give him a mohawk as well, shouldn't I? Continue that theme. I see. Oh, I could, I could give this one a top knot so you've got this burst of colour coming out of the middle. Would you like me to do that now? I mean, it's 11.02. Would you like me to go grab some, some spare noggins and see if... And see if I can do... Yeah? Yeah, that's a yes? Yes? Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll be back again in a second. Alrighty? <laughs> Alright. Huh. Alright. Alright, I'm back. I've got bits box with bits. So, I've got me Clan Escher girls. As long as you're happy for me to go a little over time, you want to stick around? Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, find, I'll find some hair. For example, I could give... I could, I could give a top knot like that. Pop that off the boss. I think I might I might grab that one. Uh, I think I think we'll I think I might grab that hair. I'll quick look through here. Cause I need some hair that's gonna stick up far. You know what I mean? Like it's got to really whoop. It's really got to be able to stand out from from inside the vehicle. Put that over there. Oh, well, I suppose that is a good point, Skits. <laughs> so, now I could give this great big top knot to this dude, but that looks a bit odd. Yeah, that'll do. Alright. Put a big boomfy thing of hair on this dude. Okay, so we got one wild mohawk, uh, top knot sticking out from the from the driver there. <laughs> that looks mad. I don't know how much how well you can see it, but that's a big that's a crazy great big top knot going there. I'll put a little bit of glue on the inside there as well, so just to make sure it doesn't pop off or anything. Do you like that? I like that. I reckon that looks cool. Now for the cyborg on the top. I'll grab some Escher hair. One day I'll get around to building the Escher girls. By the time I do that, they're all going to be bald. Because I've <laughs> put all their hair on the orcs. Oh, uh, Skits. If you get a chance to go get the new uh, uh, female Katachin, um, um sergeant that's available at g -Dub, do it. It's a very, very neat looking model. You really want that one, mate. Okay, so, so hair for that guy. Hmm. It's your birthday tomorrow. Well, happy birthday for tomorrow. That's very awesome. I had no idea, and now I do have an idea. Well, I'm not going to buy it for you. Well, I might. Hmm. PM me. Send me a send me a PM as how much it costs. We're not going to discuss it now. Ow. 
which of these hairstyles for the lunatic on the top? See, they're okay hair. They're not. I don't know of how much of it's going to transfer properly. Although, that might be funny. Uh, Facebook, please. Ow. Okay. He looks happy and kind of scary there, right? But if I go give him the side hair, I wish I could show you that properly. There's a little weird fringe thing and a, and a top knot at, at the back. He looks positively delighted to be here and sl and fairly ridiculous actually. I want him to look fantastic, not fruit cakey. You know, like I don't want him to look. I don't want him to look stupid. That's a harder part. Maybe this bit. Now that would be cooler if her, if his head was in a different spot. Because then I could make the head... Oh, well, that's okay. Well, what if I just... If I just use... Okay, what if I just use a ponytail? Like I cut, I cut the rest off. And then I drop it on the ground... And I don't know where it's gone. Nope, there it is. Nope. And then I accidentally break the back off the ponytail, so the whole thing's ruined anyway. Alright. Oh, there's a backup one. Excellent plan. Hmm. <sighs> Try that again. Very carefully. You're as careful as I ever get doing this sort of thing. Oh yeah, that's just too good really, isn't it? Nah, that 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 fits almost too well. Shave his head a little bit. Take some of that extra off. <laughs> Get me glue. Ow. All right, Cinder. I think you're going to be happy with this one, mate. <laughs> Look at that wicked top knot, a uh, great big braid coming out the back of his head, and flowing over his, flowing over his shoulder, as if it's meant to be there. <laughs> yeah, that's brilliant. That is, I'm loving that. A little bit more super glue just to make sure one it doesn't pop off and two it'll give me a nice because this is this is thick super glue it actually almost works like it, it um it fills in gaps and when it dries it contracts but doesn't but not like a liquid it, it sets almost like a little putty or or a gap filler there we go gloriously flushing majestically flushing in the wind yes there we have it. Let's see if, if I turn that off. Can we? Nope. Okay. Try different color. That's a little better. Let it go. Okay. So, for those of you paying attention at home, we now have an orc with an incredible braid running all the way down the back there. 
<laughs> which matches, which goes well with the orc in the majestic hairstyle sitting in the driver's seat. Orc Punzel, this is fantastic. We have a an ongoing theme here of majestic hair for all my orcs. There we go. Not all my orcs, just those on the on the vehicles. Actually, I'm going to run out of hair pretty quickly. But we've also got the ninja, the gun grot out hanging out the back. That's great. Alrighty, well, as I said before, 12 minutes ago, thank you very much for joining me. Thank you very much for coming along in this mad journey of discovery. Um, hope you have as much fun as I did, because that was a lot of fun building. That was a good, good time. Uh, next week, I'm going to get back to painting. Next week, I'll get back to uh, for trying to finish off that death copter and getting some more paint onto this guy. And, or... Either Def Copter and then a Titan, or, or, or moving back onto this. So we'll figure it out. We'll see what you guys want me to do. But thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for coming along tonight. And I hope that you have a most excellent rest of the week. Um, yeah, take care. Uh, t t try, try, to, try to stay safe in the COVID climate. And, you know, do it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just have a good one. I've run out of words. I'm really tired. I'm very sorry. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Thank you very much again. Hope you have a excellent week.